So you've got this website. You've put all this time and effort into it. You've created posts. You've created videos, maybe. You've put all these nifty things in the sidebars. You're getting lots of comments. Well, have you ever thought about what would happen if you lost it all? You really need to think about some way of backing up your system. And the way I've chosen to do it is with a plugin, and it's called Duplicator. So I'll show you that now. We go down here on our WordPress page to Plugins and go over here to Duplicator and it tells us that it will create a full WordPress backup of your files and database with one click. And I've been using it for, I don't know, a couple of months now and I really like it because you can take a backup of everything, um, videos, um, comments, blog posts, everything on your site and you can either use that to move it to another site or you can simply take that file and keep it on another system for safekeeping so if anything should happen to your website um, you can just replace it very easily so I typically do these every few days I do a complete backup of my websites with this duplicator plugin we'll go over to the uh, duplicator plugin web page um, it's from a, a company called lifeinthegrid.com and the fellow's name that designed it is his name is Corey and um, it's a great plugin I don't have anything bad to say about it so um, go over there and um, it tells you about the installation um, frequently asked questions let's look at some of those screenshots, um, just various things that you might need when you're installing it. And then to use it, it's very easy. You click on Manage. Okay, we're back in our WordPress admin page. We click on Manage. We go up here. For some reason it sticks the .com on the end and the duplicator plugin doesn't like that but as you can see it put in 2012 June 06 and 27 is the day and then it puts the name of your website on it so once you have um, the backups are called packages so each of these is a backup that I've done and it's called a backup package and so to create the package it automatically puts the name in there you go over here click on create package and it asks you if you really want to do that and here's the size you click on OK it compresses it and creates a file this website doesn't have a whole lot on it so it doesn't take very long only a few seconds so as we can see 19.47 and I think we had 35 megabytes or something to start with so it did compress it and uh, shrink it down some so um, now we can copy that package so we go over here click on package and it asks if we want to download that and I say save it and it says it's going to take uh, 30 some seconds to finish saving it over here it's 45 percent done just a few more seconds to go to download it and all of your folders with all of your WordPress content are saved so it's really a nice backup tool and something that's easy to run so that if something's easy you're going to use it and so that's why I recommend this alright thanks for watching